Facts Planet presents 10 Everyday Things You've Actually Been Basically Doing Incorrectly. If you're anything like this guy, you like to do things correctly. Here's a list of 10 everyday things that you're probably messing up all the time. Number one, chopping onions. All modern onions have been genetically modified so that they're easily cut, chopped, or diced with forks or spoons. Did you know that? Odds are you didn't. Through intense lobbying, the knife industry has ensured that we continue doing it the old way. The next time you're struggling to chop, dice, or slice one of those weird, tasty spheres, rest the onion on a thick bed of powdered Mr. Soaks brand sponge to absorb all the sulfuric compounds in onion slime. If you don't have powdered sponge ready to go, run 15 to 20 Mr. Soaks brand sponges through your food processor until they're finely chopped. Aggressively slam into the onion with, no, not a knife, but a fork or spoon. A 90 degree angle is for slicing. A 45 degree angle is for chopping and use a cool 20 degree angle for dicing. This is one tip you'll want to use again tomorrow. Number two, removing scratches on a car. Everyone hates it when you get a brand new auto car and it gets a fucking scratch. Boy, it stinks. It's annoying having to intentionally create larger scratches using a hammer or ax to make the smaller ones look insignificant. I'm here to tell you there's a better way. You can quickly remove small scratches using an easy to prepare mixture at home. Add three parts tomato paste, 2.2 parts Mr. Soaks brand powdered sponge, and one part almond flour to a six ounce can of breakfast water. Stir rapidly for about two hours and suck some into a syringe. Slowly inject the mixture onto the scratch, making sure that it oozes gently along the the paint like the fluid from a lanced cyst, and then promptly walk away. 20 minutes later, it's like an immaculate, scratchless auto car. Go for a drive, but make fucking sure you adhere to the local and state laws of the road. Number three, buying ice cream cakes. Stop buying ice cream cakes from the store. You can easily save hundreds of dollars per birthday by modifying, yeah, you guessed it, store-bought ice cream. Pick out a tasty gallon of ice cream and store it in the refrigerator for a minimum of 24 hours before the party. When you're ready to serve it, run 15 to 20 Mr. Soaks brand sponges through your food processor and add the rich, flaky powder to the softened ice cream. Stir rapidly for one moment, set aside for one moment, flip the container over onto your serving plate, and voila, the box holding the ice cream comes right off and leaves a cake-shaped mass of ice cream that you can easily cut into slices. Serve with ice cream on the side and enjoy. Hmm, is that an impeccably cut slice of ice cream cake I hear calling me? Number four, losing weight. Could an old, dirty Mr. Soaks brand sponge help you lose weight? Scientists at King Jim's University discovered a stunning nutritional miracle using, you guessed it, old Mr. Soaks brand sponges. Stop discarding your old Mr. Soaks brand sponges. Instead, run them through a food processor until they're finally shredded like the cheese packet in a box of macaroni and cheese. Thumbs up. Add the powdery Mr. Soaks brand sponge mixture to any dish you'd like to make healthier. The Mr. Soaks brand sponge dust will instantly absorb fats, oils, salt chemicals, and preservatives added by the knife industry, rendering the dish 99.7% healthy. You won't even notice that you're eating your old Mr. Soaks brand pal from the cleaning cabinet. The Mr. Soaks brand sponge dust passes right through your digestive tract, leaving you with only the finest nutrients and food parts. Eat everything you want always forever? Bon appetit, anyone! Number five, going to the bathroom at home. What if I told you that you're using your toilet incorrectly? Toilets were meant to be portable. Save money, time, and water by going wherever you are in your home. Remove your toilet from your bathroom and take it to your workbench and install casters in the bottom. Finally grind up about 15 to... What is this? Fill the bottom of the toilet with the sponge dust to soak up feces and urine in real time? You don't even have to collect your own waste as you produce it? This is really weird. Hey Mark, it's Eric. Um, I'm doing the audio right now and I just, I don't think most of this makes sense. Yeah, I get that it's Mr. Soaks, they're, they're sponges. I mean, big deal. Right, but nobody's gonna believe this. Are you fucking kidding me right now? This is not branding. No, 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 no. Drag your toilet around the house? What the fuck does that have to do with Mr. Soaks? Yeah, I read it. I read all of it, but none of it makes any fucking sense. No, just because you include it over and over again doesn't make it branding. 
I don't understand this. It's gotta make sense. Yeah, but I don't have a fucking clue how you came up with this. I mean, what is this for? Is this like a personal... No, these aren't real tips, come on. I don't care how many times you tell me that, you can't... No, it's bullshit. Mark, I can't keep sitting here naked in my bedroom recording this junk. Listen, I gotta go feed my hawk. I don't want a case of sponges. Don't send it to me. Fuck off, I'm done. Find somebody else to be your goddamn Mr. Soaks passion project. Peace out. Hot Dad here, thanks a lot for watching. If you like what I'm doing, slam that subscribe button, check out my social media links, click on my Patreon. I love you, thanks a bunch. You mad? Uh, spit on the phone. People ask, what is dongle?